Hey everybody, welcome back. So, we gotta build up our retinues more. So, basically just run the clock for that. We're super, super close to Holy Orders, and man is that ever going to change the game! Catholic Uprising. Well, good. I hope you guys deal with Catholic Uprising forever. Are you still completely broke? They're trying to work it off, but yeah, they, they are seriously in debt. Yeah, they are horrifically in debt. Wow, his personal army is actually really bad. Um... I even am catching up to him on a retinue, although my personal domain levy is crazy compared to his. Um, what is the epidemic right now? Camp Fever? Okay, I think Camp Fever is one of the lesser dangerous ones. So, uh, other goals right now either than, you know, run the clock a little bit. We want to take Cornwall. That'll also require we fight with um, you, King of Northumberland, and we can actually claim almost all of Northumberland for this lady, who's one of our courtiers. Um, I want her to be my vassal. And I can't give her a landed title? I don't have any land in which she can hold. Damn. Any other claimants here? Because I can have one more direct vassal. Hmm. All right, let's check. I want Petty Kingdom of Northumberland. No claimants who will join me? Come on. What about you? You're another one of my courtiers. I can only claim York with this guy. Yeah, apparently I can't even claim on behalf of the other person. Damn. All right. Well, those two have an alliance and we can deal with that. Um, we got to wait for a threat to decay, which... Oh, it's about to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that'll dissolve very, very soon. Uh, oh, I can make a friend? Yeah, I'll talk more. And bitter rivals. Cool. Some people became bitter rivals. Okay, I can pick an ambition. Haven't done that in a while. Ah, oh, seem real prosper, but... No, I'll hold on to that until after. I'm probably going to die before five years anyway. I'm a drunkard, stressed, cancer patient. I'm not going to last that long. Okay, good. The defense pact against me has dissolved. Don't need to worry about that. We're making a little bit of money, but again, you know, rat no. Um, okay. I probably want to just move... Yeah, let's let's just move all of my retinue to Ireland. And then we'll move it from there. Actually, you know what? I could just walk you there and then boat you there and that'd be perfect. Um, okay. Yeah, I think we want to take Cornwall next, probably. And then we'll deal with Northumberland after. Cornwall, really easy. Oh, our court chaplain died. Wasn't he our, also our... Medic and he was really really good because we need a doctor and we need a good doctor. Yeah, we need to recruit a court physician We'll see if the one we get ends up being good for a chaplain as well Okay, dropped you off so you can go down. Okay What are you you are I mean you're a renowned physician so at least there's that and you're young a pirate Sure I'll hire him. And, uh, we need a chaplain, though. And we want a good one. Oh my god, you're talented. You are very talented. Come to my court. I will give you a much better position. Here we go. And we will hire you. And you will get hunting apostates. You're even better than the previous person. Okay. Uh, you max out at 500? Yeah, because you're just two groups of retinue. Okay, well, our retinue cost just went down then, because two of the retinue groups, uh, we are now paying just the regular upkeep rather than the reinforce rate. Uh, good, because we really do need the money. Okay, um, you're part of a defensive pact against Hispania. I'm happy that there's a defensive pact against them, because Hispania is the Umayyad Empire at this point. Unless, did they change their primary title? 
No, they're still Umiata. Okay. It'd be hilarious if they changed it. Uh, for a second, I thought they conquered all of that. They didn't, right? Oh my god, they did! It's so hard to tell because it's like the same color. Holy shit. They have like Gao and stuff. Oh my god. They really blobbed out. In the Abbasid too. They start conquering down here a lot. Oh my god, the world is just chaos right now. Okay. The Catholics are going to have to push back soon. Because if you look at that, it's kind of pathetic. <laughs> the yeah, Catholics, it's pretty much me and Lombardy. And then, you know, the British Isles. Catholicism is having a bit of a rough go of it. Our more moral authority is still 100, though, which is good. Because the last thing we want right now is a whole bunch of, uh, like, Cathars and stuff. Okay, um... Send it to hiding, don't need to do that. Domain too big, but only slightly. We'll deal with that later. Um, I think we just want to declare on you. So you have 2,000 troops. Really, you have so much more than you would think. How developed are your lands? You only have one castle here. You only have one castle here. This is well upgraded. Wow. What's their tech like? Not bad. Not bad in Cornwall, at least. Wow, they have more troops than I thought they would. What about you? Okay, so the grand total, these guys are gonna throw, like, five and a half, six thousand troops at me. Okay. I'm gonna have, I mean, vastly superior troops. So, I'm, I'm pretty confident for the war. I wouldn't mind an alliance with someone. You're defending against some people. Yeah. We still don't- we don't have familial ties anymore. It's less important now that I have an alliance because I myself am quite powerful, but still. He's defending against the Umyad. Yeah, That's not fun. Especially because he probably will lose. Kinda tempted to jump in and help. Okay, we really want to take Cornwall though and make it into a merchant republic. Uh, that would mean I need to get my hands on the, on one of the two titles in Cornwall. And the the Duchy of Cornwall, which I don't think exists yet. Oh no, you've got the Petty Kingdom of Cornwall. Yeah. Once I take the land, I can then, you know... I need to take the Duchy title from him, and then one of the Count titles from him. So he would hate my guts. Uh, I would probably just try and find a way to steal it from him. Because I don't want to be considered a... Um, oh, what's it called? I don't want to be considered tyrannical. Anyway, uh, speaking of not wanting to be a tyrant, let's just declare war on him, because we are the we have a de jure claim on Cornwall because of Wales. So, you know... War is declared. His ally will probably join in. Where is the fleet? So we got 13 ships there. We could just send these ships over to help bring people over. We'll do that. I think that's our whole fleet. Oh, right. We have a little in there. Yeah, we're sending quite the fleet. And, uh... Raise our personal levy. And this should be plenty. Now, we could do our vassal levies because that wouldn't cost us money. Let's just say we did that. That's that's 8,000 troops. And we're rocking another 2,000 over here, counting our retinue. Okay. Let's put down... Let's put down our personals and just bring out the ones in the capital itself. And those are the ones we'll move over. So we're looking at 5,000 people. Okay, so we don't actually need any of the ships up here. Okay. Put down the vassal fleet and just have our personal fleet here. And that's plenty. Okay. Run the clock a little. Let the people gather up. Got a bunch of gold. Good. That's always nice right before a war. All these people are starting to march and meet up. Good. Just brought all the uh, retinues together. We could probably just jackhammer them hard if we want to. 
Uh, who are you of Lombardi, son of <laughs> son of Lucifer? I didn't know you had that nickname. Uh, but I do want ties with you. Oh, but you just want to marry my Corteir? The one who's got a weak claim on Northumberland, or at least one of the ones who does. Why can I not press your claim on Northumberland? Like, seriously, I don't know. I don't want to marry her away, though, so sorry. She's not family anyway. Oh my god, I should probably just run in there. Well, they're basically undefended. Yeah, we can just stomp you. You're not even marching. Okay. They did call Northumberland in, though, which is pretty much what I expected. Okay, that was an absolute massacre. And you know what? I don't care about you and you. Uh, did barbarians show up? I always say barbarians. I, what do you call them? Where'd the boat? N not large enough. What do you talk? Oh, right. I'm an idiot. For some reason, I had the idea that boats could hold more than they could. No, boats hold a hundred people each. God, I... Look, math, guys. I probably should have brought the other ones over. Uh, let's split more. You go over first. I should have brought the other fleets over. Look, it's not the biggest deal in the world. We'll be fine. And, well, you're here. Bigger group, just walk there and walk back. And Smaller group, you walk there and walk back just to put the fear of death into them. Consumption broke out. Okay. We've got this huge group right there, all build together, and just do the usual... Uh, you're the flanker? Yeah. There you go. In fact, that group's huge. Maybe I just want to slam into their army. Get a bunch of really quick war score. There you go. And is that taken care of? Yep, you got, your guys are coming back. Hey, boats. Get going back. And that can't actually split up more. So we are actually going to raise uh, the fleet. Oh, I didn't even realize I had people over there. Uh, yeah, we don't need you. It's okay, Netherlands, we don't need your troops right now. Oh, hold on, hold on. Captured a prisoner. Are you Chinese? Yes! I believe you are! Really strange to see over there. Are you one of the barbarians or the Vikings attacking? Well, yeah, you're from... The Who's your liege? No! You... are up... here? What the hell? You're from the Han Dynasty, you're Chinese! What the fuck? Oh, you're from a... Uh, you're a raving band. Okay, you just happened to be here. Got it. God, that was... I was so confused. Yeah, we're handing over you ten bucks, I don't care. All right, and they can all build together and deal with that. All right, I'm a court. That's cool. Get there, and there. We're sieging all of Cornwall. All right, we got quite the fleet here. Embark whoever we can. Get that going up there. All right, yeah, this will go fine. They're trying to siege a little bit of Wales. I don't really care because the actual war itself is going perfectly fine. Wow, Northumberland is actually trying to siege Spain. Okay, I thought they would just, you know, go to Cornwall, try and back up the Cornish army. Oh, sweet, one of my guys became a flanker too. Good, 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 good. Uh, was it not a guy who's already a commit? Oh no, it's the it's the crap guy. Okay, well whatever. He's on the side anyway. Yeah, our two side guys are both flankers. That's awesome. Okay, yeah, deal with that. 
It's more than enough boats. Good. Unsuccessful raid against the besiegers. Good, because we are the besiegers. Okay, we're doing great. Board the boat, and I don't care if no Northumberland comes back and tries to put up a fight. It won't really be a big deal. And just boat the other army over. There we go. Put down all the ships. And you can go up there and deal with that. All right. Yeah, this is going really well. Yeah, look at all those victories. I don't care if it's a river crossing. We'll completely annihilate them. Even without generals. Uh, devious plans everywhere. Someone's trying to kill my son. He'll be fine. Won that fight. That was big. All right, you can stay in this general area. And we'll just keep going with this. All right, this is an easy fight. There's a hostile siege. Oh, right there, the Cornwall army is sieging up in uh, Brittany. Okay. Didn't see it coming. And uh, balance-wise, we're losing money. It's a shame, but uh, we'll be fine. In fact, I think we can put all of them away. Yes, pay the money, keep the trade route coming, because it's a huge net profit of money. There we go. That was easy. And enforce demands, which will be the land and a little prestige. There we go. And a title can be usurped. The petty kingdom of Cornwall. <laughs> what? Oh, I have people over there, apparently. Uh, and put all of them down. Don't want to piss them off. Oh, and you. I totally forgot I have so many people over here. I should have put down. That was stupid of me. Um. Okay. There we go. There we go. And then all that's left here is the retinue, which is fine. You can go park up here. And we can put away these guys. Yeah, forming a defensive pet against me is fine. I'm threatening. That'll decay fast. We're doing statecraft and everything. Um, this guy's trying to convert me to Satanism. Uh, hold on. Our money is perfectly fine now. That's good. Someone usurp, yeah. Why is it bringing me to this county? Oh! I directly own this now. Okay, I didn't even realize. Uh, I'm stupid, right? Because I'm not claiming it on someone's behalf. I'm claiming it for me. God, I'm an idiot. I can make that merch republic right now. You're trying to convert, convert me to Satanism. I can tell already from the picture. Dinner, plenty of drinks. Uh, immediately stop conversation. So we've begun. Uh, yeah, heretical ideas. Do not speak of this. You Satanist. You're possessed. Of course you're a Satanist. Yeah, I, uh, I don't think we should be getting too close to that guy. Who's, why are we killing this guy again? Oh, Muslim. Yeah, yeah, he totally wants to kill us. Yeah, we'll kill him. Um, title can be usurped. Um, yeah, usurp that title. Because I wanted that title. Fuck that guy. There we go, we usurped the title. And now we're going to immediately give this away. So what we're going to do now is the thing I was talking about before. We're going to make a merchant republic. So, uh, mayor of this city or this city? I mean, it could be either one. But this mayor is probably much richer because this city is significantly less crap. Hey, buddy, what do you think of me? Uh, you don't really have a strong opinion of me either way, either than you don't like vicious rumors about me, which sucks. You have very bad stewardship, but whatever. You are going to be the guy anyway. You're about to love the shit out of me. I'm also going to invite you to go carousing with me uh, because you're going to be hard to appease just because you'll be a merchant lord and I want you to like me. More so, uh, you're going to like me a lot because I give you shit. Okay. First, I give him the county. So I'm going to give him the county of Cornwall. Boom. You can see here, yeah, still republic. He is the count of Cornwall, but he is in a republic. I am then going to grant him the duchy that he's in. So the duchy of Cornwall. Boom. A, a great new house has, a, has risen. At the forefront of Cornish politics under patrician. 
And you can see it rose up all that. He is now a merchant republic ruling over uh, the county of Cornwall, but also the duchy of Cornwall, which means he probably wants Devon. Uh, yeah, he wants, he, de he desires the county of Devon. I don't want the county of Devon, so it's yours. There we go. He loves the shit out of us now, which is awesome. And he's gonna generate a lot of money for us. If we go to government, this is now still blue background because the liege of the whole kingdom, uh, which is me, is feudal, feudal is blue, but it's got the red stripes saying that the leader of the individual land is of a merchant republic. So there we go. Merchant Republic, you can see the head county here now is now the city, not the castle. Uh, it's It was just looted, so it's going to have bad money for a while, but he'll take care of it. Uh, these guys tend to get very, very wealthy. And uh, hopefully he'll reinvest a lot of that into the city and make me a lot of money. He's also going to start building trading ports. If I go to trade zones, none yet. He's going to start building them all over the British Isles, probably. Oh, yeah, yeah, the Packed against me, whatever. I don't care, everyone can join the pact against me, it'll be gone before you know it. Uh, oh, he's going to these- oh shit, I gotta invite more people, I totally forgot. Uh, invite my wife, gotta make sure she likes me. And vassals who have a poor opinion of me, I will invite- this guy wants me so, so dead. Why? Let's see in council, man, he wants a lot of stuff he isn't gonna get. Sucks to be him. Some of these guys are really fucking paying lower tax than they should. Maybe they should appreciate that more. Now, a lot of these guys I can't invite to Krasin because they rejected it recently. Come on, go Krasin with your good buddy. The king. The four-time king. Don't you guys want political power or something? All right, that's plenty. There, invited a bunch of people. There we go, hey, they're agreeing. Except for this person, what a douche. I think he's my uncle too. Yay, or rather I'm his uncle. Also my wife agreed, that's awesome. Gotta make sure you have a good relationship with your wife. Uh, I could bribe her to like me too, couldn't I? Yes, I could. Not going to, because uh, I'm probably dead soon anyway. Okay, uh, so if we look at the Kingdom of Wales, the Kingdom of Wales, we own all of the counties, and they're only 10, own all of them except for these two. And unfortunately, this one right here is the best county in Wales. Wales doesn't have any really good counties, but this one's the best one. It has the most holdings. So you could potentially make more castles there and get a decent levy and some decent money. Vassalization? Hmm. Small difference in rank, come on. What, because you're a duke? Come on. What about you? Are you also a duke? Yeah, petty kingdom. Hate him. Absolutely hate him. We could make another kingdom right now. We could make two, <laughs> two more kingdoms if we want to. Do. No point, no point! I already have messy enough succession laws as is. Actually, well, my succession law is not messy unless you're looking at Wales. Germany and Wales, God knows what's going to happen. Oh no, you know what? Wales is going better than I thought. It's uh, Ireland, who knows. Not the biggest deal in the world, again. If we lose some of these kingdoms, but they stay our vassals, it's not a big deal. Really, I want to be an emperor. Because I don't think they would stay our vassals, necessarily. We need to really become an emperor. Um, and I'd like to do it during my lifetime. But we need a lot more land for that. I'd love to claim all of Holster. We're going to need to start declaring a lot of wars. But we only have so much time. Yeah, threat decay speed is faster with a good chancellor, so we're trying to get that down because I don't want a defensive pact against me when I do this. I want Northumberland. That is so, 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 so much land. Do we, we have levies raised? Apparently we have a vassal levy raised somewhere. I just put him down. I want Northumberland and I want it bad. Who will join in? 
okay. Weird. I don't care if you join in. Um, yeah, you're a lot weaker than me. Get on the border. Um, I want their land, and I want it soon. He has a defensive pack. Oh, opposing me. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> what, do you have familial ties with the Imiad Empire? Um, no, of course the Imiad Empire would be in the defensive pact against me. A son was born. Oh, a grandson. Okay. That's fine. Elected a new mayor of the Republic of Cornwall. The old one must have died. Uh, yep. This new one doesn't love me like the old one did. He wants the kingdom of Wales so he can just shut the fuck up. Uh, did you make any of those trade posts yet? No. No. Losers. Hate them. Okay, gotta run the clock some more. Oh, we can speed it up again, right? Because the, the war is over. Improved relations with the Duke. Good. I want that statecraft constantly improving relations. Lost my spy master. 20. That's pretty good. And you're malcontent and you're paranoid. You know what? Never mind on you. Hey, you seem good. Way of the leopard and way of the dog. You're weird, but I'll take you because you're very talented. You're very talented. I can't wait to never see you again because you're going to be in the Byzantine Empire stealing technology. <laughs> okay, um... God, this crap down here. It's a peasant revolt. Could take advantage of that. Um, but I want large chunks of land. Like your land. That'd be cool to take. I only have a de jure claim on one little thing. I want your empire. That's what I want. What do I need for a tributary state again? I need a majesty of four or greater. God, I want that. I'm not anywhere close to getting it up to four. That's expensive. Yeah. It is good. Magistry is good. It's just, you know, not my highest priority in the world. Um, hmm. God, we want this before we die. We want this so bad. That is so much land in England. That would be so valuable. Who's the claimant again? You? I just want to give you a landed title, but I'm not allowed. I'm not even sure why I can't. Are there really no other claimants that I could convince to join me? Really? Why would you guys say no out of interest? Like, how about you? Why, why would you say no? God. Okay, we'll deal with this after our threat decay is taken care of. Okay, have your party. We're having- wow, the sentiment was really quiet that time. I barely even heard it. We're having a great time carousing. My comrades say I should slow down the drink, but that's nonsense! As some of them won't like me as much because I'm clearly a drunkard. I'm also getting an epic hangover where for one full year my diplomacy is down. Shit! That's not gonna make my people like me more. 30% chance to remove stress. Come on, come on, it'll help me live longer. And stress is actually really detrimental. Did I? No, I didn't lose it. Come on, man. All right. We're partying too hard, everybody. On the next episode, we let wave this threat to decay, and then we see how much land we can take in England as fast as possible. Until next time, have a nice day.